Hello again. It's Albano Ace once again. Still in the same room as before, but now I'm doing mission 15. Now, judging by the host's actions from mission 13, the one in the mountains, I'm not sure he has what it takes to get the S here. But I'll try to help him out anyway. Let's see. Standard missiles, XLEAs for the choppers. Yeah, that's right. I'm taking a MiG-31 into a canyon. Because I can. Yeah, when tuned with, um... Let me see, I'm trying to think what I have on it. I know we have rocket motor mod. And light armor. For the engine and armor. I can't remember what I have with the wing. I'm not sure if it's blended wing body or actuator. I think it gets one of those two. I can't remember off the top of my head. But yeah, it's not too bad for a flying brick with those parts. And still has decent defense, too. So, I'm happy with it. It's mobile enough for the canyon, which surprised me at first, but hey, it's nice to know. I'm not complaining. Joking. You're the one who wanted to fly the 747 through this area. Not our fault it had to be through a canyon. Hey, can't you be a little quieter? Since you're paying me good money to fly you through this canyon, I thought you'd be a little more grateful. But no, no respect at all. What a waste of my time. How do you like that, Mr. Olivieri? My god, the voice acting in that scene is crazy. And by crazy, I mean bad. Like, terrible bad. Oh good, someone's already hanging back to take care of the two choppers. So I'll push on ahead. Oh wow, so the A-10 got him. That's the guy who flew the F-16 in the mountain mission. Well, it was mission 14 for him. I guess he knows what he's doing. Let me go ahead and thank him. I just hope the host knows to pick the right path. Which is pretty fantastic here, because the opposite of left is the correct path to take if you want the S. So it's pretty fantastic. But yeah, hopefully it takes the right path. Or else. Uh, who the hell is taking the left path? The screen shaking is really annoying. I'm in a brick as it is. I need confidence in my maneuvering. Who's the idiot doing that?
Okay, we got all the enemies. So despite the shaking canyon, I'm going to go ahead and meet up with Monsoon. So maybe if I fly right in front of him, he'll follow me into the right path. Maybe. I don't know. Okay, time to turn. Yeah, and look at what side I'm on. Look to me, to the wobbling flying brick. Okay, he's right on my tail, this is good, this is good. Yes. Good so far, keep it up, keep it up. Yay, I think he took the right path. Yes, he did. Good job. So, there's a possibility of getting an S now, and I don't have to deal with these stupid mines. Flying high in here means having to worry about the canyons less. You can cut more corners. Which is always useful. What? I was below a thousand, so who the hell did that? Yeah, you get noobs, that's right. Sometimes you get ripped off, Mr. Rowe. You gotta deal with it. I'm willing to bet it was the XO2 who did that. Any day now. Thank you. Keep it moving, keep it moving. Same arm as before. went to turn on the ceiling fan because it was getting stupidly hot in here. So nowadays, three random inaccurate missiles from one side constitutes completely surrounded. Well done, devs. Well done. God, this game is so... It, it's so bad, it's good. Sometimes. Other times, it's just plain bad. And by other times, I mean most of the time. Okay. Take two. And action. He's going as slow as I am. That's not good. Come on, man. Step it up. You want the S or not? Yeah. If I had known the gunboat wasn't going to appear, I would have went for the choppers right away. Hmm. 
Perhaps it was Lord K who climbed too high earlier, and then he left in embarrassment. Because he was doing good, I don't know why else he would leave. Anyway. Dangerous, pointless stunts. The most fun way to play an ace combat. It won't lock. Great. I hate how a lot of the time I want to press triangle to lock onto a target right in front of me. It targets everything around me, but not what's right in front of me. I'm sure that's happened to some of you as well. It's really annoying, isn't it? That was a nice feature of A0. When you press down on the... On the right... On the... I think it was left stick. Yeah, left stick. Pretty sure. When you press down on it, you would get the little boresight circle right in front of you. And then whatever target happens to be inside it, bam! That's the new lock. Now, obviously with PSP, the functions are pretty limited, as far as button pressing and whatnot, so I understand that. But still, it would be nice if Triangle had some sensitivity to which way the camera is facing. Maybe they'll bring Borsite back into Salt Horizon. That'd be nice. Anyway, we'll have to wait and see. Right now, my concern is that Monsoon picks the right path again. Which I think he will. Yep, he did. Well, gee, if you can spend money in such a fashion that it will change the engine in mid-air for a faster one to make the plane go faster, if that were possible, then yeah, your statement would make sense. But seeing as that's not possible, you're just being an impatient corporate bastard. A nice remark from him! Or at least, half ass nice. What a surprise. So you want safe and fast. You feel you don't have enough of either one. Man, you're a spoiled bastard. Two barrel! Can't disappoint Peppy Hair now, can we? Okay, so maybe some of you can, but that's beside the point. Why is he even bothering over there? The nice thing about having a target over there, though, is that the camera will rotate. I get to look at my nice and make that one. Yeah. What did you do? Crash? Idiot. <sighs> you know what? I think at this point it's hopeless. I I'm just gonna leave the room. Some grand flight that was. Well, thanks for watching. See you guys around.